What's going on there, happy person? I don't know who you are, and I don't know where you're watching, but I want to tell you I appreciate you taking the time to hang out with me. This is my truck. It's kind of dirty. I got all my all my gear in it right now, and I'm on the interstate heading down to Miami International Airport because I'm going to be meeting up with a crew of guys. We're going to be doing a big time bird hunt. We're going duck hunting, dove, perdiz, pigeons. We're even going to be fishing for golden grotto. It, it's one of those trips that's like a, a bucket list, like chance of a lifetime, incredible opportunity for me to be able to go down there and take both of my camera guys, David and Austin. You know, it wasn't long ago that a trip like this would have been totally out of the realm of possibilities for me. It's not a cheap trip. This is a fairly expensive trip, but it's one of those things that you have to work towards and work up to. Um, and I know a lot of you have seen me come from the beginning days. I mean, drop a thumbs up if you've been here since before 50,000. 50,000 subs. When I hit 50,000 subs, I was like, oh my goodness, this is for real. And I am going somewhere with this. So if you were here before then, drop a thumbs up and tell me what, what's kept you here. This like, what's kept you interested in deer meat for dinner? Because this has changed my life in such a huge in dynamic way. It's allowed me to afford to take care of my family and many friends and other people. Uh, it's allowed me to go places and see things and do things that I would have never otherwise ever been able to do. And with that, I want to, I want to encourage all of you, no matter where you are, you may be a multimillionaire sitting in a palace on the ocean, or you may be living somewhere in complete, in a bad spot, in, you know, financial ruin, and you just mentally you may be down and out of it, and you may not be in a good spot. And whether you're in a good spot or whether you're in a bad spot, I want to give you something to think about. The ocean is not always calm. The ocean is not always rough. So during the calm periods, realize it's not gonna be calm forever. In the rough times, realize it's not gonna be rough forever. So one makes you enjoy the other more. Oh, see like, look at this right here. See that? That's a fire up there. I guarantee you that's coming out of a home development and the fire clearly just started. You can see the start of the fire right there. but. That, that's a perfect illustration of what I'm talking about. Those people may be having the best day of their life. They may be, they may have just won the lottery, who knows? Next thing you know, house catches on fire and everything goes sideways. It's scrambled eggs before you know it. But that doesn't mean it's the end. And so for those of you who are out there and times are tough, health concerns, financial concerns, whatever it may be, Maybe it's relationships. Realize that the road to recovery, it starts today. And it's a short road. It's today. Just do what you can today. I've told you guys many times that one of my old coaches back in high school, Coach Primus, used to always tell me, Arrington, keep moving your feet. Keep moving your feet, boy. Because if you keep moving your feet, when they stop, you win. So if you're out there and you're in that position and you need some help, only worry about today. You can't jump ahead a year. You can't jump ahead five years. All you have is today. And so often people, they get so focused on the future that they lose sight of where they are and they, they're focused on what they're going towards and they walk right past opportunities that are far greater. So don't worry about the big picture. Worry about 
where you are right now and how can you get out of this hole? The only way you can do it is day by day. Today, when you focus on the day, that's the day that is at hand, that's the day that you can deal with, that's the day that you can work with, and if you just put your mind to it, like, you know what, this is my day, and I am going to do the best I very can. Whatever job you have, go into the job. If you don't have a job, say, you know what, I'm getting a job. And whenever you go, if you're applying somewhere, if you're filling out an application, if you're meeting with a potential boss, tell them, say, man, whatever job you got for me, I'm gonna do it to the best of my ability. I'm gonna show up early every day. If I need to stay late, I'm gonna stay late. I'm gonna be the best employee you've ever had. Just give me a shot. And if they say no, keep moving your feet, keep working. And once you get that job, man, prove them right. People are always doubting, you know? Everyone wants to talk, 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 you know? Politicians on every side of the road, talk, 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 talk. Man, people in all walks of life, talk, 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 talk. Real winners are the ones who walk, 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 walk. They don't do a lot of talking. They do a lot of walking, because the proof is in the pudding. So, get that job. Show up early, man. There's nothing somebody likes more than to see somebody show up early with a smile on their face, ready to work. Whatever obstacles come your way, tackle them. Tackle them as if, as if your life depended on it and you've got to get it done. And guess what? Not only will your bosses and the people around you appreciate your work and your vigor and your dedication but man I'm telling you it will flip a switch inside of you and it's like it's like a food it's like it's like power inside of you when you as you start to accomplish things and get somewhere like me whenever I first started this YouTube channel everyone thought I was crazy man but on my on my bulletin board every time I would get a new hundred subscribers I would write a hundred and sometimes it was only a hundred per month and I remember when it was 100 every week. And then it got to a spot where it was 100 every day. And then 200 every day. Heck, now I, at times I get two, three, four thousand 4,000 new subscribers in one day, man. It's it's like power and, and bite by bite, piece by piece. It, and it just presses you to do better and better and be more responsible and to be more honest and to be more hardworking and to be more accountable. So all I'm telling you guys, don't worry about the world says. Don't worry about how big the hole is that you are in. Man, wake up every day, say thank you God for the opportunity to give it my best. I watched a YouTube video not long ago where a man talked about when you wake up, make your bed because that's a choice. That's the first small task that you can do that day. Make your bed. And then go out and give it your best no matter what you're doing. I don't care if you're digging ditches, cutting lawns, turning wrenches, building houses, or if you're a brain surgeon. Everybody in this world go through ups and downs. Ocean's not always calm. Ocean's not always rough. The more money you have, the more expensive your toys is. That's it. We all smile when we're happy. We all cry when we're sad. Life affects us all the same. Don't matter what color we are, we all bleed red. Don't matter what religion, what race, if we're rich, poor, nothing. Everybody has to look themselves in the mirror. I promise you guys, if today, starting as soon as you watch this video, you decide tomorrow or even today, just right now, right now, that's it. Day by day, I'm gonna give it my very, very best. I am going to try my best. Figure out what you gotta do to keep a smile on your face and keep them feet moving. Keep working hard because I promise you, it wasn't but just a few years ago I couldn't have dreamed of going on a trip like this. Now here I am, going, taking two camera guys, going down to a place that dreams are made of, y'all. I'm so honored, I'm so stoked to have you watching my video. YouTube has changed my life. YouTube has given me a platform 
to spread the message of love and peace and outdoors and catching and cleaning and cooking and living that organic lifestyle before organic was even cool y'all YouTube thank you thank you for what you've given me the opportunity to do everybody out there thank you for all the shares the comments the likes the support the encouragement because I promise you you guys mean more to my family and I than you will ever ever know I hope this wasn't some silly little rambling job. I just want y'all to know that I love you. Take care, God bless, and I will see you in Argentina.